Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we have Marvel Flux, the card game. So Flux has been around a long time. There's lots of different versions. There's zombies, space, all that kind of stuff. So now there's a Marvel Flux. It's been out a little while. Sometimes you can find this pretty cheap, <clears throat> depending on where you go. On Amazon, it's $19.99, which seems way too expensive. I think I got this for maybe $12, $10 or $12. Uh, on the board game geek, it's got a 6.6, .6, which is pretty good for a Flux game, I think. Uh, it also says 5 to 30 minutes playtime, which is a bonus, I think. So I played some Flux games. I think it's the Batman one or the Zombie one. It can take a really long time and actually gets to the point of being boring and tedious. So didn't really like the way that Flux kind of flowed. So this one's supposed to be a shorter one. Uh, you, you play cards, the rules change. Uh, this one comes with a collector's coin, like a Captain America shield. So we got some keepers over here, and the goal <coughs> flex the card game. Ever change the rules? Collect keepers to match the current goal to win. Change the way you play with each new rule you play, each new card. All right, so 100 cards, one collector's coin, instructions. So we're just gonna open it up, not really go through gameplay. Just want to see how everything looks. Always one more piece of tape. There we go. Nice box. Nice art on there. Quite a few superheroes. Something from more of the MCU. Let's try to play. It's pretty nice. So flex turn token. And so I don't know if this coin comes into play in this game or not. Maybe. Maybe you flip it. So as it has as a turn marker. It's just fine. Pretty good weight to it. So that's pretty nice. Uh, instructions. <coughs> I'm not ever a fan of these kind of fold-on instructions. Just give me a booklet. But I don't have to fold back up. So, anyways, let's take a look at these cars. Here's some other stuff: Time Breaker, Pyramid, some other games. So it's pretty nice packaging for just one big deck of cards and this coin. Up there so a lot of cards you can see gives us some replay value so you so it's pretty random so you won't see the same things over and over again in the same order which is nice so I haven't got to try this one yet but after seeing it, it only takes five to thirty minutes it's probably definitely worth trying out get your basic rules Shuffle the deck, deal three cards to each player, choose someone to go first, keep this card on the table, draw one, play one. Right. Keep that down so everyone can read it. So who we got here? We have Spider-Man, Keeper, Captain America, Thor, Rocket Raccoon, Groot. Uh, While well you have this card in play, you can only say I am Groot. It's kind of text on there. If you fail, you must move this to another player of your choice. So you get the keeper. The Hulk, Iron Man, Spider Gwen, Black Panther, Shuri, Thanos, Bucky Barnes, Winter Soldier. So you stuff like an Infinity Gauntlet. So once during your turn, you may take the top card. From draw pile and play it immediately okay so i guess if you don't have anything in your hand you want to play you just put the top card of the deck of the draw pile got gamora ant-man wasp star lord <laughs> drax 
Hawkeye, Black Widow, Falcon, Doctor Strange, some text on here. Once during your turn, you may take a random card from another player's hand and play it. Loki, during your turn, you may exchange this with uh, any other keeper in play. So I guess if you want maybe something that does something, exchange that. Goal, you need Thor and Loki to complete this goal. Uh, these are just matching two heroes, looks like, two people. Entire <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy, or well, any three, so getting all five would be annoying. Got the Winged Warriors. Alright. Right, so goals, goals, goals. I'm going to spoil every goal just in case you do want to pick it up. Get the idea. Alright, you know, Action Arena. That's Lots to read, and we're gonna read it. <laughs> Same as snaps of fingers. Yeah, all right. Cosmic cube action. Choose one. Steal a keeper. Put it on the table in front of you. Discard any two cards. Play new rules. Keepers or goals, or draw three cards. That's kind of cool. Cosmic cube action. I'm thinking. I guess all flex may backs are like this, maybe, since I think they're combinable. So don't quite remember. So team ups. And we have some rules here. So we have the whip. Once during your turn, you may take the top card from the draw pile and play it immediately. Okay. It's very similar to Doctor Strange. Or, um, it's like Strange or Loki. Can't remember. Spider Sense. Special option. Once during your turn, when drawing cards, you may draw one extra card. Look at them all. Put any one of them back on the draw pile. Alright. Spider Sense. That makes sense. So I'm going to read all of them. Play four cards per turn. If you have fewer than that, play all your cards. So that's standard kind of flex stuff. So yeah, all these are just kind of regular flex things. Steal the keeper. Everybody gets one. Trash the keeper. Simplify. Discard your choice. Up to half. Round it up. Put the new cards in play. The basic rules can never be discarded. Reset rules, discard and draw, jackpot. So, <clears throat> all your rules there. But of course, the main draw of the game is the superhero flavor stuff, which is the goals. So, there's quite a few. A lot of goals. And then the keepers just have pretty good art. So gameplay is simple. You start out like it says, deal three, draw a card, play a card. Looks pretty good. And like I said, it being a shorter of the flex games, I would, I would recommend it just off that alone probably. <laughs> um, five to three minutes is plenty of time. You can play multiple games or just one maybe 30 minute game. And then you can be like, okay, we're, we're moving on. So that is... Marvel Flux card game. So, nice coin. Components are standard Flux stuff. So it's all pretty nice and a nice box. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to help the channel grow. Thank you.